Hey folks, I'm Surveying Glory and welcome to part 54 of my Crusader Kings 2 campaign as Scotland, Scotswahi. Uh, I'm playing as King Ninian, the, the frog as some would have it. Uh, and it's been going okay, uh, a bit slow at times, but we are slowly expanding. Um, we also have a couple of tributaries, uh, Essex and Hwicket. So this whole area here plus Hwicky hold the Northern Ireland so overall can't really complain um, at the moment we're trying to fabricate claims and powers here in Shrewsbury and in terms of the factions um, neither of them are particularly a threat I'm just letting this guy here. Is this who were um, the Duke of Lothian leading troops in York? I, I think the fact the faction that was in here must have disbanded. And since it's not much of a threat, I'm just going to well, actually send you to study technology. Should we do that? Um, yeah, go over here. And yeah, you continue organizing the army. Are we doing any building at the moment? Um, maybe in York? Nope. Nope. Uh, how about Gowrie? Yeah, there we go. So that's fine. You continue to oversee the building. Let's move on. So, I have oh, the Great Seljuk. Turkish cans come and go. Indeed they do. Um, I would love to take over this kingdom completely. Uh, I don't see them ever agreeing to become a vassal. Oh dear I. Uh, no. She's not at peace just now. Who are you at war with, actually? Clean Burgundy. Okay, your heir is the King of Burgundy. Oh, the merchant caravan. Use your words. Um, let them in. Tell us more about this mythical realm of Hindustan. Oh look, you've left as a man. I should actually have had a look at that to see <laughs> how good he was. Uh, where is he? That's him? No, he's the court, court physician. Negus. Yeah, okay. Of course he's a eunuch. Your Marshal, Duke de Bourde of East Anglia, has put forward a plan for experimentation with new military technology, inspired by a supposedly brilliant inventor and engineer that he has recently befriended. All that is needed is a little funding. You shall have it. Thirty gold is nothing. Nothing to me. Uh, excellent. York has become Pictish. Now, if only we could become Scottish, it would be even better. Sophie died, dear me. How are we doing on tech, actually? Can we... Yes, we can invest in... In what? The popular customers is only going up by 1.4 per year. Everything else is going up pretty quickly, so this would give us uh, improved city vassal opinion. Let's go for that. Screaming Arrows, you receive a report on the outcome of the military experiments that John Marshall asked you to sponsor. Apparently a new kind of self-propelled arrow has, was tried out, based on Far Eastern models. Lit by fire, these arrows would scream and fly away, leaving a trail of smoke and then explode on impact, killing several of the livestock used as practice targets. 
Unfortunately, on the second trial, several, several of these missiles misfired, one striking the engineer dead and another nearly killing the marshal. So we lose 10 military technology points. And Duke Taboot suffers the consequences. Um, economy tech. That's going to put 6.2, 6.2, 6.2, 1.6 in trade practices. So let's. Uh, yeah, stick the money in there. The money, the points in there. Yes, I'd forgotten about that. The plague does approach indeed. What can we build in Scone now? Go away. Fortifications, not really needed right at the moment. Morale of armies and reinforcement rate. Retinue size. 115 heavy infantry and 50 pikemen. I like the sound of that, by God. Middle East is ravaged by plague. When will it end? After it's been over here and given us a good scene too, no doubt. So, let's clear out these. No. Oh, did your did your mum die? Something like that. Pretty tiny. And Duke has secluded himself. Persia ravaged by plague. When will it end? No, I'm not shutting the gates. Go away. Oh, my god. It spread incredibly quickly. Maybe I'll shut the gates. Shut the gates. No. Too late. Keep the gates open. Very well, let's follow your instructions. Domain too big. Give me a foot bath. It was freezing. Need your minor ravaged by plague. Uh, let's see, who is our heir? High Chief Ninian of the Isles. High Chief Ninian, pause. Let's get our retinue. <laughs> Come on. High Chief Ninian of the Isles. There he is. What's, what's he doing? Oh, he's my steward. He's overseeing construction. Well, that's fine. Oversee construction then because the plague hasn't quite reached Gowrie yet. So, stay where you are. Uh, gazing at the moon. Plus 0.5 health. I wonder if it's too late to join a religious faction. People are dropping like flies. My swollen lymphs have blackened and burst, spewing out blood and pus. I have contracted the plague. Oh dear. Alas and alack. And the court physician has come to see you and offers treatment for your illness. I trust your knowledge, O oh wise one. The Bible is different work, but cleansing through fire is an art as old as the world itself. Little did you know that he could, he would have you walk over burning coals. Mystically altered. <laughs> King Ninian the Frog gets mystically altered, turned into a princess. Uh, and again, the trait brave, but I lose lots of things. Uh, yep, people are dying off at an alarming rate. Brood Sirson, Kirsten, whatever. Oh. Right. If everyone could stop dying just for a moment. My spy master, I sent, <laughs> sent him out into the middle of plague ridden Turkey. Uh, 
the math brother yep fine do it and just do things in York that'll be fine minor titles uh, court physician Drosten and I think we'll leave the rest for now Prince Kneon oh he died of the cancer oh and I've died of another thing the council of the isles Uh, what? Okay, um, have new air. Yes, yes. King Ninian the first has given up the ghost at age fifty. He died of the dreaded plague, known to be kind and as the frog. Few had a bad word to say about him, apart from calling him a frog. Uh, a godly man, Ninian is with the Blessed Virgin. King Ninian the second, being a talented military technician, tactician. Expect to lead us to many victories in the field of battle. So be it. Okay. Bam. Family. There's a rare. Well, I'm, what? Back. Back up. Who's this? Oh, he's on the Knights of Calatrava. You're rubbish. Okay, let's go about sorting out our kingdom. Unlanded sons. Can they take the black? Hmm. I do have too many provinces. Okay, fine. Go into hiding. Yes, where's York? Crown focus. Thank you. Council of Discontent. Alpin of Ulster owes me a favour, thank you. Title loss in succession. Uh, nominate succession successor. And I can usurp four titles. None of them really of any use to me. So, new thank you. Right, you, useless. Um, become... Yeah, so I'm going to keep Gowry, Fife, Strathern and Athol. And Richmond. So I'm going to give away Darby, or Argyll. Yeah, take her gale. Why don't you? My good man. And you, with your lovely pigtails. Uh, so, what am I going to give you, Lincoln? But no, because that's part of the de jure duchy of York. Which is mine. Um, so what else do we have? Lincoln York Derby. There we go. That's the one for you. You're welcome. Uh, so I guess the Chief Walchus of the Hebrides got the plague. I should pick an ambition. Indeed I should. And I should get out of war focus. Um... Build a war chest fairly quick. And let's switch this to Intrigue. Nah, it's not really going to make that much of a difference. It's not really worth it. Let's go for. Mm, yeah, just straight stewardship. And on we go. Nice. Yes, the plague. Uh, we're aware that it's approaching. It's made a close approach already. Yep. 
more death. <laughs> Even more death. I can put my finger in what's wrong with you. Uh, oops, hang on, quick. Who am I going to nominate as my successor? Could be you. You've got claims on Albany and Durham. Small potatoes. Yep, Breath, Earl of Chester. Half-brother of my dynasty. You the man. Award honorary title. Uh, yep, Seneschal. Send. Uh, and designated regent. 2.25 monthly prestige. And... Uh, 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 Is he already a commander? I don't I don't have any commander slots perhaps. What can we do in the realm? Anything? What? Domain size plus three vessel limit down. We're almost at the vassal limit for some reason. My vassals. Um Revoke titles. Enforce religious control upon subjects. Hmm. Additional succession laws. Late feudal administration. Hmm. What should I pick? Oh, hang on. Let me check my council. Have I got a c Are they all dead? Oh, yes. Look. They all died. Chancellor. Good. I guess that was my favour. Marshal. What? Two people that love me in the council. Uh, Earl of Lancaster, Breath, Earl of Chester, my half brother, my heir, needs to be on the council, Spymaster, um, and a powerful vessel, put you on, and this is an awesome council. Bang. And my... Who are you? I might get rid of you. You don't like me at all anyway. Oh, jeez, I might have known. Okay, okay. Fine, fine, fine. Back to this. So, plenty of supporters for that. Let's split 50-50. Additional succession laws. But the vassals who refuse liege interference in wars. Being seen as traitors appeals to me. Hmm. I'm just thinking if I... Increase my domain size limit, but I reduce my vassal size limit by 5. I'll be at 15, 14 or 15, so it's not really worth it. Um, let's go for late administration. The importance of keeping the inheritance together to facilitate their dynasty's long term increase in power and wealth. In this system, there is a tendency for vassals to grow more and more powerful with time if not kept in check. Allows additional succession laws, vassals who you repeat. Yep, okay, go. Actually, I should have looked at this, shouldn't I? Yeah, well, never mind. Um, except, go. And got my new 
air in, just in case I die. Which is likely. My dear half-brother, I was just approached by Eustina of Palaio Castron, who tried to convince me to join her in her vile heresy. Who is this person? Palaeco. Palaeo. Um, oh, engage her in theological debate. One moment I'm shifting, alas, again. Okay, is it the ice foot bath time? Smallpox as opposed to great pox. So you're just a courtier. Never stray again. Okay. Oh, your husband's died. Quite good stewardship skills. Can I arrange a marriage? Um, from a marshal. Yeah, you're a good match. I don't know why you'd want it to be matrilineal, but fine. Uh, whatever. Um, excellent. Oh, eat plenty of fatty and well-spiced food. That's good. I love a curry. I love a curry, me. Um, you probably realised I'm pressing Total War Warhammer buttons here, trying to move the map around. Uh, these are dark days when my prince, son, Prince Ulrich, U, was beset by high fever. Compromised physician. Uh, huh. Okay, stop, stop, stop. Fine. Uh, cramps. Nasty disease, is it clearing up yet? Um, uh, might be. Oh no, oh, measles. How dreadful. Okay, we're poised, that's why nothing's happening. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. These people aren't all dying. Prince Uchu of Scotland. Yes, I thought he was my son. He was a bit rubbish. Uh, okay. Um, let's check out. Slot zero should be the one to... Right, stop. Yes, I've got the plague now. Let's... I said stop. Bugger off. Um, ditch this land on someone like Morleo. How would you like to be a prince? You have malaise. You're going to die. Maybe you'll pull through. Um, yeah, we'll trust that you'll pull through. You can become the what? Give me faith or tell a thought. Argyle, yes. Argyle is the one for you. Um, I'm lost it now. Where did it go? There it's. Okay, yes, my life is in your hands. What now? Prince Morley of Scotland has inherited Chieftain of Clydesdale and Countess Countess Moore died Okay Duke Drosten buckled the last strap securing you on the operating table I will not lie to you my lord this will be excruciatingly painful but it must be done You tried to protest when Drosten brought out the saw but due to the calming potion he had made you drink you slurred your words beyond comprehension one-legged. My last days, I'm going to be spent hopping around. 
Ah, uh, yep, my wife's got it. Should I have shut the gates, do you think? New Year. Oh no, not Urgoth of Mori, he's a... Not of my dynasty. Well, I suppose he is. Don't want to be him. Um. <laughs> this guy, it's got to be him. He's too old, 49. I want to be a young king. He's got a fever as well as a malaise now. There's no point nominating him. Hedonist. That will keep him healthy and safe. Uh, nothing really floats my boat here. Forty one, you've got the malaise. Okay. Duke can you the fat? Nominate him. And uh, we better, while I remember, grant a reward honorary titles. Take that. Okay, well, I'm going to put a break in here. Right, let's pause in case I die. Um, I think this is friendship. Probably reading too much into this. Hmm. I'm not that interested in being friends. I've got one leg and I'm dying, so my time is short. So yeah, I'm going to put a break in here. Uh, we'll pick this up again in the next part, and hopefully we'll see the Black Death recede, uh, and allow us to focus on conquering some weak countries. So thanks very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. Please leave me a comment and rate the video, and I hope to see you again in the next part. Cheers.